there's there's something which alludes at the end of the film which alludes to how they can change and they can survive a lot of things um i've got ideas in number three to then take it a bit further um, and they'll kind of evolve and change um and get bigger because i there's an the idea i want to play with is that as the threat to these creatures grows so like winnie the pooh owl piglet tigger and that as these oppressive forces get stronger on them they push back against them um so you know as the neighboring towns and the villages um kind of put this increasing pressure to kill them they adapt and they grow in order to combat it so what's going to happen in number in poo free or poo universe is poo's going to get bigger like what happened with number one to number two number two to number three he's going to get bigger he's going to get more muscular like taller um we're going to have him like look more scary so something which happens at the end film happens to half his face so we can kind of alter that and change that and give him more of a horrifying look so a bit of a weird eye um piglet can have a bit of a distortion on his head because something which happens to him early in the film so we can kind of adapt and change them into these um yeah, into like something which kind of evolves with the franchise rather than it feeling yeah, like the like designs Chucky. are changing. Yeah. Yeah. So the yeah. designs aren't changing for no reason. There's a justification to why they're becoming more horror y and more scary. Yeah. So, like yeah. With, with Winnie, like Chucky, he has all like the cuts down his face. Mm. So, we kind mm. of want to introduce that maybe with like poo and stuff. So, the damage that happens to them is a part of their look in the next film. 